Hey golfers, I'm Drew Mahola, Second Swing Golf, out here on the golf course with Emma Carpenter and Bella McCauley, uh, two, as I said in our previously filmed video, lethal golfers <laughs> in their own right. But um, we have a very fun one today um, because, as you guys know, this is a club fitting oriented channel and we absolutely pride ourselves on getting golfers fit into clubs that fit for their game, right? Well, today, Emma and Bella are going to play clubs fit for the other person. So we're going to swap their clubs um, and play this par five. So. I'll start with you, Emma. Um, you, I think we've talked about already the differences in your guys' clubs. Are you nervous about this? Are you excited about this, about playing a hole with Bella's clubs? I'm interested. I'm excited about it. Like, I mean, I feel like, I mean, first of all, I feel like a giant next to you, Bella. Like, <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm like, but actually our drivers are the same, same length, which we just learned. Yeah. But I mean, I know that your clubs are just like a little bit lighter than mine. Yep. Um, so it'll just be interesting to see how they feel. Maybe they'll feel really good. Like I can feel the club face if they're like, if your irons are a little bit shorter, yeah. sometimes you can feel the face a little bit better, but I don't know. I probably like mine, the way that mine are bent and everything. Like I definitely like get the most out of my irons. For like sure. I'm used to hitting 100%. them pretty long. I definitely probably won't be able to hit yours as long yeah. as I hit mine. So mm -hmm. off the club up, yep. but yeah, I'm interested to see how it goes. I'm excited for you to hit mine too. Yeah. It's crazy. You know, we've been teammates for two years and, but we play such different clubs that I think this will be like really a big test of switching clubs for people because it's not like we play anything similar at all. Like she said, mine are a little lighter. Hers are a lot stiffer. And so I think that'll be really interesting to test out. I'm most, I think one of the most difficult parts will be in terms of just like the stiffness and like maybe it's a little bit heavier. I'm not sure how heavy your clubs are, mm -hmm. but in terms of irons, I think will especially feel the most different, but it'll be interesting to see. Yeah. And I also yeah. want to tease one more video we're looking at today with you know, if you guys get short of the green or around the green with the wedges, there might be a big difference there because I know the bounce. Uh, but oh, talk, talk about lethal. It's yeah. so funny because our wedges are so different. But I mean, yeah. Bella has an insane short game with what I would think a wedge that I could never play. Right, right, yeah. So it's like, it's I could it's never crazy. play your wedge. So we'll see how this goes. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, let's let's see some tee shots here. All right. Okay, perfect. I'll go first. Here, you got to use mine. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, yeah. right, right. <laughs> the whole point of the video. All right, let's see it, Bells. I'm interested to see. I don't think you've ever hit my club before. Ever. Like, not even just on the range. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Stay out Stay of the right water. There. I think it's it got a kick left, but I think I it's fine. I think it'll be fine. Yeah. It's oh, kind my of God. Flirting with that First of all, side. I never see you miss it left. I know it wasn't because of my club, but I'm going to, like, <laughs> say that it was. That's well, why I miss it left. Hey, I, honestly, it probably could have It's just my been a lot to do with yeah. the club. I mean, you're, feel, you're swinging right. something completely all different. The club. That's funny. For all we know, I know she had just said that her miss was left um, with driver when we were talking off, off camera. So maybe this is when she hits it right. Your I, Bella doesn't really have a miss, so... <laughs> Bella, if you if you do miss it, where would you say you miss this club? Left. Left? Yeah. Oh wow, that's smoked. Thanks. Starting to peel that right. Really well hit. I think you're left of that bunker though, yeah. That is hit yeah, pretty far. I think that's okay. Pretty good start, I think, for both of you. It's you should all right. play. Alright, let's do it. I'm taking Emma's six iron. How does it feel? A little heavier than mine. <laughs> the grip probably feels kind of weird. Oh yeah, yeah. this is. The this will grip. be interesting. Oh, you got like mid size. I Balls did have mid size, way but those are still double wraps. My those feet. are standard. Oh, okay, Bell. You know what? That's it's out. out. That did feel really weird above my feet, but. You know what? We're out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, new new iron, long iron, and the ball above your feet. That's yeah. a tough combo. Not a great, not a great mix a of things combo. for a good shot, but it still works. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We're good. Okay. Little win in the face. It's only like a 180 cover on the furthest bunker though. So, okay, Bella, now I want to ask you, what would you do? What would you do? What would I do? Well, this one, I would, I would probably go over the bunkers. You would? Okay. Yeah, I would hit probably a draw over that right bunker. What club would you hit? Well, I don't hit it as far as you. I'd hit three wood probably. Just hit a draw over the right bunker. How far does your the green? Okay. I hit that about Are like you... two hundred to two ten. You got a lot of head covers in here. How okay. Yeah. What do you got a 
two hybrids? I have a four hybrid and a five hybrid, which are basically just like iron form. Okay. And, and then, then seven wood and three wood. How far does your seven wood go? Uh, similar to the four hybrid, it's about like 190. Then why is it in the bag? Because <laughs> it just goes higher. I wonder the same question. <laughs> um, I feel like your three wood might be too. I'm gonna hit your three wood. I'm 225. Like All right, yeah, I'm, just go for it. Why I'm, not? I'm 225 into the wind. I feel like I feel like the other clubs wouldn't quite wait. Now the wind's helping. I think the wind might be actually helping you. Yeah, I feel like it's. Which one goes further, Bella? Your four wood or your five or your seven wood? Seven wood. Seven wood goes further. A little bit, yeah. Is that the, is that this one? Yeah, that's why I have it in the bag. Well, also because it just goes a little higher too. Okay, okay. That's what I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with Bella's seven wood. Okay. I only have a three wood. I have a three wood and a, a three hybrid in my bag. Okay. So. Yeah, this is, it's different than, so you don't have a club like this in your bag. So this No, is very, no, this is different. This could be fascinating. Oh no. Oh, hang on there. Oh man. Uh-oh, we got a- Oh, that's gonna be a tough shot with anybody's club. We got a fun sand shot coming up. That's gonna be a tough shot with anybody's club. All right, so what did you get for a distance here and what club so, you looking at? So, for... 116, which normally I'd hit a nine iron, but I don't know <laughs> if, if that's I, what I should hit now. I feel like, I mean, my clubs are bent. Like, I okay. mean, I play my pitching wedge to go like 135, but- Oh gosh. I, well, I mean, I know I swing it a little faster than you, but like that's heavier, it's stiffer, and it's like lower lofted. Like it's-, it's, so it's Okay. So what should happen is it should, I guess, it should go launch lower than you're used to. Okay, maybe I'll just like really choke up on it or something. Cause I don't know if I can get a pitching wedge there. I think you can, Bella. I think you can. Trust it. Okay. Well, we got okay. Caddy, Emma Carpenter, advising the pitching. Wedge. All right. I know. I don't right. know if we're supposed to be competing against each other. We're trying to like help each other through these shots. No. Okay. We're gonna do pitching wedge. It's a it's a light competition. We're we doing pitching wedge. Do let's well. let's see what we. I we think got you here. can get my pitching wedge there. All right. All right. Ooh. Was she right? Oh, oh, right on the front. Oh, bad caddy. You hit that too. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's the nine good. iron was uh I think the nine iron good. was the right call. Oh, it's all good. Oh, you hit it nice. How does it feel? I actually like it. <laughs> <laughs> I actually like it. It's very, way better than I thought right. it'd be. So, Emma, now this is kind of that, it's almost that weird bunker shot that's kind of like Bryson at the US Open where it's like, a long, almost uncomfortably long shot. Yep. Um, for try not sure. to put weird thoughts in your brain here with this one, but <laughs> it's uh, how, are gonna, how are you going to me, Drew. How are you going to play this one with with Bella's clubs? Well, I feel like this is just long enough where like sometimes the longer ones, uh, you can take like a lower lofted club and like still play it like a, a bunker shot where you want to say sand behind it. Yeah. This one, I'm going to try to pick clean okay. just because it's like yeah, I got it's you. too far. I mean, I'm a good, I'm a good 30, 40 yards. It's actually. Like, I was telling you on the way here, it was actually the right distance. Like it was the right club. Yeah. I covered the bunker back there that I wanted to. I just went in this left one. Yeah, I just kind of pulled it a little bit. <laughs> yeah, a little, right. little double cross. Well, this is one of those tougher shots in golf, so I'm curious to see how it plays out. Yeah, this is this is an objectively a very tough shot. We'll see. I don't like the lie either. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I do not like that lie for this shot. Jeez, I can't believe. <laughs> That came out like way better than I thought it was. <laughs> yeah, you're yeah. picking it really clean. Here, I'll, I'll rake. I just don't need to swing it that hard. Jeez. This like, is all my fault too that she's got this long putt. <laughs> she wanted to hit the nine. Yeah, so are you? So maybe you were trying to do some competition here. I wasn't you know? trying to sabotage her, I swear. Because it, it, it does appear, I mean, the viewers may have questions. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> so. They're gonna be like, what's Emma trying to do there? So on a long putt like this, are you like <laughs> trying to gauge exactly a, a number or is it more feel for you? Um, It's like, complete. I'm a very feel person around the greens. Okay. So we have pretty similar putters too, don't we? Yeah, yeah that I mean, this is, guys this is too... longer and heavier, but like in terms of look, it's very similar. We both have, is this a Scotty too? Yeah, we yeah. both have Scotty yeah. blades. So All right. just trying to get a good feel. Hopefully we can leg it up there. Oh, 
little more. Oh, that's not too bad. Good speed. That rolled yeah, out pretty good well. Pace. It's pretty that good from there. That's like nice. 70 feet or something. Yeah. Not bad. That'll work. What's the game plan? You gonna hit I, the hill? Like, I, I mean, I, I'm not gonna be able to stop it if it lands on the ground. Right. There's no way. Put some spin on it. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to bump it into that hill. I'm serious. I think you're probably right. Yeah. Or putt it. I don't know. I was gonna say or putt it. What would you do from here, Bella? I'd probably hit that. <laughs> How? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. So yeah, 14 bounce K grind, so it's not meant to be open on the yeah, lob kinda, wedge. You kind of can't open the face with that. You, you, you sort of have I to. I know. On a tight lie like this, like yeah, if I opened it, I would blade, right. I would hit you guys. <laughs> I've definitely struggled with the high shots. Yeah. I definitely need my wedge here. Oh, wow. There we go. Okay. That's so good. I don't think I could do that again. <laughs> I really don't. That had to be so perfect, just right Bella, on the top of the slope. I know. I do not know how Here, you do this, Bella. Perfect. Save the par. Oh, good oh, putt. Oh, she does. Good putt. How's that Thank putter you. feel? I actually like it. Like I said, it's a little bit there, longer and heavier, but it's different grips. It looks like, and maybe for different sure. lengths. Yeah, this, she's got a thicker grip on here. But it but does help you guys. Like, it's the same I mean, it's the same model, model roughly yeah. similar club. I know yours is a lot older. Yeah, mine's so quite I, quite I remember an old in our in a podcast episode we talked about how long you've had that putter. So long time. No kidding. Wow, a couple Perfect. bars. Perfect. All right. Good job, Good Bells. Job. Good job. Well, so what's the verdict on playing clubs that are not fit for you? <laughs> I know it was a little bit ugly at times. I mean, for you guys, because you guys make birdies on holes like this. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think like for me, that seven wood miss was just the kiss of death here. Yeah. I feel like I shouldn't have tried to like muscle it because that's probably what caused that yeah, left sure. miss, especially yeah. with a lighter club. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. No, for me, um, just a little off, off, off the tee, which then I'm in the rough, but I would just say like, kind of just like the, it being, your clubs being so much heavier mm -hmm. was definitely something different for me. Also having such stiffer clubs, just harder to feel like I have good contact yeah. and things like that. So um, definitely we'll be sticking with mine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> your, uh, and your wedge, that was the toughest thing, I swear. I don't know if your wedges are lighter than mine. I have no idea, maybe not. But when I was in the bunker, I swear, like it felt like so light. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's, you know, we got, again, a, a video coming on the wedge difference between you two. <laughs> but uh, the fact that you had a bunker shot and then that tricky little pitch. I don't know which one was harder. With her wedges was, was, so was tough, hard. but we, we saved the pars. So congrats to both of you for that. That's, um, on the spot pars with not your right clubs is impressive. So um, th today, this is why golfers should get fit for their own clubs. So they're not yeah. making uncomfortable pars and swinging clubs that don't fit them. So uh, Emma and Bella, thank you for joining us today. Um, that was a lot of fun to watch. <laughs> Thanks. That yeah, was yeah. so fun. It was cool. Thanks.